Final chapter in a story that placed a dark cloud over Atlanta Public Schools. Nearly 200 teachers were suspected of changing answers on standardized tests. 35 teachers were indicted. Tonight, Atlanta News First reporter Rachel Aragon is live to outside the Fulton County Courthouse. And Rachel, today the final five educators connected to the Atlanta Public Schools cheating scandal withdrew appeals of their convictions. Correct, and those five defendants speaking out publicly in court today, apologizing to all the students that were impacted by the scandal, and some of them even saying they are deeply remorseful for their actions. The remaining defendants in the Atlanta Public Schools cheating scandal appearing before a Fulton County judge Tuesday. And it sincerely hurts me that it had to end this way. Yes, I take responsibility. One by one, five defendants withdrawing appeals of their convictions tied to the scandal that first came to light in 2009. That's when an eraser analysis revealed a large number of answers on standardized tests across the district had been changed from wrong to right. State investigators initially implicated 178 teachers at 44 schools within the district. That led to 35 educators being indicted, accused of cheating. Some educators eventually confessed, while 12 went to trial and 11 were ultimately convicted. I understand the need to make amends, and I will continue to work tirelessly in my community. But on Tuesday, the remaining defendants closing the chapter on an over decade old scandal and sending a message to those they impacted. To the children of Atlanta, I am writing this letter as my personal apology to the students in Atlanta Public Schools and to take full responsibility for my actions in this case. And several other defendants also speaking out, taking responsibility, they said, for their actions, especially apologizing again to those students who were impacted at that time by this scandal. We live in downtown Atlanta. Rachel Aragon, Atlanta News First.